She was more like. I know, why are they so. Why? Ah! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to clap. I'm a married man. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Give it to me, Jaden. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's Clay, director of video here at CZ, and I have my much less fashionable friend than I, Nava Rose. Hi everyone. So Nava, today we're gonna be reacting to videos of BTS's Jimin, yeah. or how do you pronounce it properly? Jimin. 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 All right, she's our resident expert. She's definitely <laughs> army. She has BTS parties at home, so. And I have a tattoo. Uh, wait, you didn't know I have a tattoo? Oh. Ooh. I too have a tattoo. It's right. No, I'm just kidding. A BTS? <laughs> I'm just kidding. We put a post up in our YouTube community area, and so many of you commented about what videos of Jimin you wanted to watch. So thank you for that. We're gonna be reacting to exactly what you asked for. Let's get started. Yeah. So this is I Need You solo. I need you. Girl. Oh, this is. I right, go for it. Oh, so pretty, it's like ultra light beam. <laughs> <laughs> so dramatic, I love this. Literally. Ooh. Whoa. Okay. Pops. <laughs> she really is just such a good dancer. Wow. Yes. Okay, I, I was not expecting this. Whoa. So good. Really fluid. Look at that spot. I'm like just in a trance right now. I love that he can do this with a scarf, whatever this yeah. is. I'm about to. We did a cheap gainer. Oh, a what? A cheap gainer. Cheap gainer. Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoa! Oh, oh, wait. I did not know there was going to be fire. This is, like, this is for the fans, that, just the moment. Oh my gosh. Honestly, him breathing. Was that it? <laughs> that was, it was it? just for the fans to enjoy. Yeah. So good, right? This was like the best first video that you could put of Jim and Jeff. It is? Awesome. Yeah. I'm glad. This is amazing. Yes, so he has like modern and contemporary background yeah. as a dancer. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. I've watched a lot of K-pop dancers. They showcase dancing, but it almost always looks like they're wearing someone else's choreo. Mm. And like, I, I didn't get that through this. Like it really did feel like this was himself Him, through it, yeah. so that was really special. He did a spin, he had a, a really nice little spot there. If you don't know what a spot is, it's basically when you're looking at a certain place, you're turning the rest of your body, and then you finish your turn, and then you whip your head yes. to finish that, so you can maintain balance. I can't even do that, to be honest. What dance training have you had before? Just hip hop. <laughs> just hip hop? I've, I've tried so many times to do a spot, and I'm just like, hey. You haven't done any like of the studio training before? No. Really? No, yeah, oh. no. When you do your dance styles, you have this like, this poise to it that makes it seem like you've been training other styles. So, really? Yeah. On to the next. That was great. Oh, this is the water That's performance. Water. Yes. Wow, so pretty. <gasps> Ooh, nice catch. Oh my okay. god. Oh, I love. love. Now a new member. Oh, oh. so good. Oh. oh. We did a little dragony thingy. <gasps> dragony thingy. Did he full, not fully get Ooh. on there? Was he supposed to fully get on there? I don't think so. Whoa. Ooh. Beautiful. I've never danced on water, so this actually must be so hard. They, they, they have, um, when you do this, a lot of times you have mats underneath that have a lot more grip, even underwater. No way. So that you're not slipping. So oh it wouldn't be like a standard tarp or anything. Wait, they changed clothes. When? What? <laughs> They're in black now. Oh, they were in white, huh? Yeah. These this outfits. Is, this is so pretty. It's like, it's art. Yeah. This is art. They're making art with dance. That was the swan. He was the head of the swan. How did I not catch that? Let's go back. Go back just a bit. I didn't even catch that. I was just so amazed by oh. effects. <laughs> Come on, effects. I was not expecting that. See, it's a swan. Oh a my wings. gosh, you're it's right. A, it's not just any swan. It's a black swan. It's a black, <laughs> it's a BTS black it's a swan. It's a BTS black swan. Wow. Cute. That was that. so fun. Launched an Articuno. A what? That's a Pokemon. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm impressed about the whole dancing on the mat thing. I didn't know about that. Yeah, it's just anything to help support like dancers because the last thing you want is for your very expensive crew of you know band members, crew members to uh, die. So, <laughs> to die. It was great for a large group, and I think they did a good job at utilizing their supporting dancers. They utilized them to help cover moments. They did use good cuts um, and allowed the dancers to all really like 
don't know, just support each other really well. Like good teamwork. Yeah, it was great teamwork. Is, is Jung Cook known as a good dancer on the team? Yeah, so they call him, I'm gonna pronounce this terribly, but yeah. Golden Magne? Magne? Which is basically like you're really good at everything. Oh, so dancing, he's singing. like a renaissance man. What video should we do if we react to Jung Cook? Leave it in the comments down below. I just, I love how he, he's just so in the moment, even before it yeah, he's starts. he's in that music. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, I love the little hand above that twirl. You know what I love about him dancing is that he's able to literally isolate every single movement. You know what I mean? Like head, neck, arms. It's just all so separated, isolated. It, it's interesting because I, I agree with you. There's isolations, but he's fluid. Yeah. You know, because it's not like, like robotic isolations. Exactly. Great stops there. Going upwards and doing these stops, it's a lot of good core and back strength. Oh, here. that's your expertise too, right? Yeah, all yeah. like biceps. Ooh. Yay. Hmm. Ooh, love the look up there. He's great, great face, it. great use of face. His hair works really well with the routine. <laughs> it does. It adds to it. Yeah. I love too when oh. It's, I don't know, for me, it was really hard for me to learn how to lose focus when dancing like this. Uh -huh. If I lose focus, I don't know, but he just does it so well I think like you, if you want to be able to use your face much better when you're dancing, you do what, what he does in the beginning. You gotta, put, you gotta put yourself in that separate world. Yeah. You gotta like relocate your whole mind to like, you're in this song. Just be in the zone. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, Ooh, you guys, yeah, it was so strong. What do you, since this is like you, like not this is mm -hmm. your style, but you're really good at hitting and all that, the, that kind of style. The, the, the thing that you have to do, if you're trying to have these hard stops, uh -huh. it's not easy to do. First of all, you probably don't make that person the one singing. If you're doing a live performance, you don't make them sing because mm. the contractions, you have to use your leg, your butt, your back, your chest, and you have to use your breath. So when, if I were to go, oh. I would physically do that to help stop my hair and to stop my muscles at that point. Yeah. <laughs> so this is why it's this is like a dance break then, right? Because yeah. he can't see. No, no, you can't sing one. I mean, maybe they maybe. can. Maybe. I can't. BTS. They can, probably. <laughs> He's so able to be fluid with his dancing. And, and it's fun because we've only reacted to J-Hope pretty much so far. Yeah. And seeing J-Hope, I'm like, oh, I can easily see his popping training. And yeah. I can see that he absolutely has some of that in him. Yeah, he, he definitely has training in street styles, but one of the things is that he's utilizing animation techniques like dime stops, mm -hmm. strobing, a lot. And so that was really, really cool. Yeah. yeah. Baby Jimin, okay. though. let's check it. Whoa! Okay. I have so, seen this video. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Look at those legs. Right? Look at those legs. Those are juicy. Yeah, he is strong, strong boy. Oh! I, I said I'm a <laughs> shoulders uh, bias. <laughs> I'm a human, human thighs. But look at those human thighs. Oh, 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 Whoa, he's body. ripped. Literally. <laughs> uh -oh. Ooh, that hole. Do you, do you see his it's point? Insane. His point? So good. Nice contempt. This control. Nice. Wow. If you're achieving quad uh, stand, then did you just? Yeah. Oh my gosh! I love these runouts. Yeah, and like the camera track. <laughs> yeah. it feels <like> so fast. <laughs> Wow. I don't know why it says ballet contemporary dance. This is not ballet. The idea is it was ballet came first, uh -huh. right? And then it goes into modern dance and then contemporary was straight off from, from both of those after that. And the contemporary pulls from every single style. So contemporary is very much like blank slate. Like you Whoa. can do what you want. And now contemporary pulls from like hip hop and pulls from all these other things as well. So it's I got a full dance education yeah. in those you one minute. You know what we do here. 
Squeegee Studio. <laughs> I'm learning today that Jimin has so much contemporary dance training. And the fun thing is that we actually have a contemporary program on Steezy taught by Karen Chuang. She is an amazing, amazing dancer. And she leads you literally through the basics of contemporary. And if you did want to get into the ballet or jazz as well, we also have intro programs for those as well. So if you want to get started with your dance journey and you know become a dancer probably as good as Jimin, you can take those classes on Steezy.co. So make sure you click the link in the description when you start taking class today. We even have some free classes. Ooh, love freebies. Freebies. <laughs> Again with the skinny jeans. He does, okay. he does a lot of those fast slows really well. Like it seems like whenever they choreograph around Jimin, they, they add a lot of those. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the drifty. The drifty? Yeah, he's a drifty dancer in my opinion. Ooh, but even his walk away is just so... You know, there's power has to great, it. Great um, posture. Oh yeah. He can like, and it like reads through his Ooh. dancing. So Wait, did you see how like big he like threw that back? He <laughs> threw it back. He threw it back. <laughs> <laughs> threw it back. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm impressed. Oh, I'm impressed that he can do other styles and with such great posture mm -hmm. and not read a stiff. Ooh, that was a nice like face drag. Whoa. Aerial. That was aerial. Yeah. Nice. He's so athletic. <laughs> It was like the finish of the aerial was relaxed, but his hands didn't do anything crazy after. Sometimes people look like they're trying to recover from a big trick. His arms do a little like swing, but it looks like he's closing the move room. Oh, okay. And it's room, room, he, he follows with how he's walking after. I don't think it was intentional. Like a fluid. I think it's just something after all those years of training, your body oh. knows how to not make it look like I just did something crazy. Oh, how do I get back into the move? He's just carried on, carried on, and went back. Wow, I wouldn't even think about that. I would just be so obsessed with the the fact that he did an aerial. Yeah. But you're like, he finished it. And he did that, that was in clean. this outfit. Great um, opening of the chest and compression of the chest. Ooh. Oh, that's very different. <laughs> oh. That head look. He has a lot of good control. Yeah. Right? It's not flaily or anything. No, it's not flaily. But like, remember, that's what I said. It's like, it's these, these fast slows, but then they're super, super like drifty still. And he's able to like fully add weight to his movements. I think that is something that comes with training in contemporary dance though, is that your understanding of storytelling and making something look heavy, making your body have a lot of tension and release. Mm -hmm. it's, it's like one of the early skills you learn in contemporary to make yourself um, just a better storyteller. He makes this, mm, like, like there's like taffy here and you can see him like he does that thing where he like, uses his body to pull and then he like adds that extra weight and tension. Oh, it's so deep. How do you like explain it? I'm just literally, I just know a move like move and you're like, there's taffy. And then you're selling the taffy. <laughs> what is this? Idol fan dance. Fan dance. Are there dan fans dancing? Oh, oh I love fans him dancing. with this hair. It's so good. I thought it was like he had a fan. Did, like, yeah, a fan? like a fan joined? I thought it would be tight. Ooh. Oh, I oh. love props. That's so good. Did he not use his hands to get up? He was on the no, he like did a little like spin. Yeah, that's so hard to do. It's a bouncy dance, the jumping dance. This looks tiring. Nice ripple, love it. Some one of the fans in the back was not on it. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, oh, that was okay. it. Twenty nine seconds. All right, then we can just Aww, go back. Oh man, I want to see him getting up now. Okay, yeah. Let's see. He like he does this. He goes down to his knee. Do -do 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 -do. Here, boom. Boom, boom. Yeah, he just stood wow. up. He just used his extended leg and the other leg to push up. That's actually really like tiring. It really is. Ooh, I didn't even know that's a little, little activation. <laughs> I love prop activations. Do you see? Oh, that oh, was, was it. Oh, wait, no, I didn't see it. Look at that. One more time. Back one more time. I, it's that guy, huh? He's that guy on the left <laughs> side right there. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, just space. calling him. Watch him watching this video. I'm just like. <laughs> <laughs> if I just like. I'm brutally honest about dancing with props. Mm. Dancing with props is something that's just not easy to do generally because we don't move with props yeah, yeah, yeah. like on a day-to-day -day basis. So having something that's like an extension of our body requires like 10 times more practice. Mm -hmm. Cause like, I know where my hand is right here, but right when I add a fan, it's like I have curvy. to get used to like my slightest turn now makes the fan go this way. Yeah. So just, you know, if you are planning on dancing with props or even like covering something like this, you, you gotta take a lot more time to make 
make sure that you're clean with it. Because it happens yeah. well, too. Smooth. Nice. Oh. Why are they so close? <laughs> what is this close up? It's giving me Michael Jackson. Vibes. It is Michael Jackson vibe. Right? You got the little like neck to do. And he does a lot of those like. Cool yeah, yeah. Oh, take that they, jacket they off. Take the jacket on him so we can take it off. Right? He said this would be great. The ladies would love this. Yep. Oh, this is the first one that we're watching him dance and sing. Oh, you're right. Da, 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 da. Oh, he's so like good. Guitar concept almost. Right? Oh, do you see that? I love this mannequin in the back. Come, come through, girl. Tripping. Whoa! Oh. Outfit change, outfit change. Makes you think about the other dude, performance dude. that I was like, they changed outfits, like it's a cut. But they did, that was quick. Right? <laughs> well, this wasn't a cut, was it? No, that wasn't. Whoa. They just threw it off real quick. Oh, that was so good. So clean. I wish it was more like that. I know, why are they so warm? Ah! I was like, we should clap. I'm a married man. <laughs> I'm not. Oh, <laughs> she's not a married man. <laughs> Give it to me, Jaden. <laughs> The performance! What performance? I'm trying to keep up with the camera. <laughs> wow. Oh, so beautiful. Huh. Right? That huh. like breakdown. See, he knows how to sell his dancing. Every time he's like looking at a, at a move, he's looking oh, at okay. he's like to the side. It just seems like there there is like uh, this is this is such a cheesy thing that dancers say, but it's so real. It looks like there's so much intention. Like I want you to look here. I'm gonna do something. Oh, oh I'm gonna look after. And it, it, and it just makes it feel like he's like the puppet master. He can control where you're looking. They can control the audience's eyes with their own eyes. Oh my gosh, that kind of changes everything now. He danced and he sang in this one too. I just don't get how people can do that. So like this little dancing. And the hat was on his head the whole time. I just get asthma watching BTS because they just like- Me too, I don't know how same. They, <laughs> I don't know how they keep doing this. It's like, this is impressive. Ooh, it's angelic. Yeah, look at the blindfold. Okay. Real beautiful. Oh, so I would hate to do any sort of like spin moves. While blindfolded. While blo <laughs> blindfolded. And it's like dark too. How are you supposed to see anything? Yes! And then that's head. it's the yeah. head whip back with that like turn. Yeah. Imagine just turning but then add, adding your head with it and having all that balance. Wow. Oh, oh so good. Nice. Hey. Ooh, powerful. Oh, I actually watched a little bit of that in the other one, but only in J Hope. Oh, it was like a J Hope focus yeah. video. Now you now you see it all together. Damn, damn, damn. Oh. Cool. oh, they're so good. Let's go, let's go. Yeah. Uh, oh look out. See that head cell? He didn't even use his eyes. I know. Face, face to the sky. Take off that blind foot. Yes, but sir. <laughs> I was only at 90%. 90%. <laughs> oh. oh. I feel gypped. I'm like, where I feel is the gyp rest? Gypped. Jim gypped in. <laughs> I mentioned in the J Hope video before, but like these sort of like breathing moments. I think they're things that people underestimate. It's like if we're telling a story or mm -hmm. we're, we're, you know, we're, we're just talking to a person, yes. we need pauses. We need it or else... It's just one big sentence. And then it doesn't like hold power. Here's my fun example. I go, you know Alexa, I can talk to you like this the entire time and nothing becomes special anymore. Or I can talk to you a little bit more like this and some things become a little bit more special. Or Alexa, I can actually talk to you like this and all of a sudden some things become so much more special. Wow. And it's like, it's, it's just so, it's silly, right? But it's kind of funny, like if you dance like that and you understand how to implement pauses in these these moments at the, at the right times, like sh oh. I shouldn't go, Alexa, you know that. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's really funny too, is that there are actual compilations on YouTube of just BTS breathing. Those moments that breathing? you're talking about. Cause you're just like watching like, <sighs> Yeah. This is an evil thing you can do to people. I'm about to do it to every single person here. I go, you are now manually breathing. And basically, <laughs> I called attention to your breathing. And then people now go like. <laughs> <laughs> and now they like think about like, the fact that they have to breathe. <laughs> now they're like not involuntarily breathing. You're just like. <laughs> they just start So if I watch people like breathing, I'm noticing the breathing. I'm like. 
<laughs> just start breathing with it. You just made a bunch of people watching this video. Yeah, I just like for ruined a second. day for like <laughs> a quick moment. Festa is uh, like the party for army. Prom party. I think that might, might just be the title. Oh. Like their theme. Oh, so theme. Festa is a word. You thought it was a misdemeanor? I thought maybe it's supposed to be a prom party. Fiesta. Fiesta, Fiesta, you know? No. <laughs> Even that little walk, the fast solo walk. Yo! Yes! That was so good. Yes! Wow! Oh, who's the one that? That's Junko. That's Junko. Yeah. Are you just paired up? Well, they're definitely the dance leads with um, J Hope, yeah. So they usually do dance breaks together. Jimin is so agile. Like, compared to a lot of the other um, people dancing, you just see how, like, quickly he reaches point A to point B. Mm -hmm. Did you catch that? What was that? Play he, back. like, swiped something. Play it's, back. like, such a dance performer thing to do. If you see something on the floor, and you saw that he, like, swiped it away to get it off the dance floor. See? see? Yeah! <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Oh, only performers oh, would know that. Oh, it was his oh. choker! His yeah, choker. choker, yeah. Oh, his choker fell out. Oh. So, so what Nava just pointed out is that it looks like his choker fell, Jimin's choker, he sees it there, he huddles above it, he Whoa. tosses it back. And that, like you said, that's such a dancer thing. Yeah. Because you don't want someone else to slip on it. Exactly. Yeah. Like this is a pretty small stage, Yeah. but you just sometimes either have to pick it up if you're about to run off stage. Yeah, but then yeah. he doesn't get a run off stage. No. He's the show. <laughs> he is the so. show, yeah. Oh, this is one of my favorite phrases. It can be easily distilled down to like, oh, he's a really dynamic dancer. Mm -hmm. But I think a lot of people don't know like, what dynamic? Well, yeah, what the heck is dynamics? <laughs> what, what I would describe it as is it's contrast. Mm. So I have this little Dr. Seuss-like phrase. He shows his fasts and slows and highs and lows. Whoa. Right? There's no middle. It's it's like a stick. Hmm. Hmm. Ta. So then you, if you cut out that middle ground, all of a sudden you get much more dynamic, interesting movement. And it, it doesn't look like you're you're just moving, it looks like you're dancing now, you oh. know? Um, so he shows his fast and slow, his highs and lows really, really well, and that's why he looks so agile when he's dancing. When did fan cam start happening? I'm not sure, I feel like that might be like a just OG K-pop thing. Do you think that like the, the camera people are just like, like do they know the set already? That's a good question. Like, they they, have they're probably to. there during rehearsal, right? Because otherwise, yeah. I mean, like, sometimes they do, they're moving. And they're yeah. Just, what are these outfits? Like they're fun, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's like your shirt. It's much better than your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that head. Yeah. Oh, his kick. Whoa. Literally so full cool out here. Engagement yeah. and legs. Literally, they're so full out. Dude, dude. Whoa, I haven't seen him like disengaged with like movement. Yeah, just like oh. you know, I've been seeing a lot of like the flowy stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Like really hard hitting in this one. Wow, wow, that was crazy. <sighs> I go back to the to the face and the head usage. Like mm -hmm. Jimin put so much effort with these sort of like head head sort of like jabs with his leg that just makes the leg movement look more powerful. Yeah. It's crazy. It's like a little like a spice embellishment to it. And do you think that's with practice or do you think he's just feeling the music? I think it's a mix. Jimin has this this head understanding mm -hmm. to use your neck, use your face to your advantage to make everything else look bigger. The same way that in the J-Hope video, I talk about his shoulders do exactly that as well. Yeah. So they, they all have these different strengths and I mean, it's really cool to watch that because I don't think I see a lot of dancers utilize their face to that extent because mm -hmm. it requires um, such high effort. It looks like okay. wallpaper on the left, like, like, <laughs> like, kind of like a motel wallpaper. It does! I wonder if they can sell precisely that jacket. Like, I yeah, will buy it soaked up. in sweat. <laughs> I'm not kidding you. So many army will buy it soaked in sweat, yeah. as is. Idol plus ending. Maybe this is like a breathing, like a breathing <gasps> ending. Okay. Is he like the king of middle parts? <laughs> Honestly? It always stays so well parted. Oh, spin! Right? Someone could. Oh, he picked up Jim! Jim got hurt. No one wants to see them continue on dancing and not help the homie. That was. Oh, like, yeah. That was dope move. Right? Oh, his mic is on too. But also, props to Jim. Look at that. Back in the game. Right? Oh, I love this. 
Chris. Go off. From what I've I've heard that he's like super sweet. Mm. Yeah. He's not he's not strong in that move. I think that when he's doing it, he's doing uh, this push here, but the continuation of it, mm -hmm. I don't think it has a full curl back to it either. Oh, so it was kind of just like a... I think it's like off. a... Mm, mm. Can you play it one more time? Hey, got, got, boo, I got, 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 got. See, he like throws yeah, yeah, yeah. it in I, I don't know if like the actual move is supposed uh -huh. to, to go boom, boom, but he just doesn't have a curl back, so he went like almost like, like a, hula. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you know, yeah, yeah, boom, yeah. Boom, yeah. Boom. But it didn't sell as like boom, boom, like the amount of effort that every other move like with his big shoulder like really sold. Like that, uh -huh. that one just kind of didn't. So the reason why I know it's like oh, it's not just because he's tired. It's because he did it for the first one as well, and every other move around is crazy. Yeah. And all of a sudden, like this one didn't sell. So do you think dancers have this is my break? move. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, I'm gonna take a breather move. Dancers 100% have break moves. The only move I'm really seeing that you're able to breathe on is these princess like wave hops. Uh. But even so, you, you have to... <gasps> So it's still not even the best thing. I don't think that was him choosing to breathe. Mm. I think it was simply like he practiced a lot mm -hmm. and that wasn't corrected. And then he just kind of stuck with it. He's oh, not the center of attention. You can clearly see he's like pushed to the side. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. probably stage directors or choreographer didn't like call attention. Hey, make sure you complete this thing. Okay? Oh, it is like he's just breathing. a breathing. He's breathing. Hold it. Let me watch him breathe. Oh, it's fireworks. Oh, it's fireworks. Mm -hmm. Why is he really good at getting up without using his hands? Uh, oh, uh, I wasn't expecting the English right there. <laughs> oh, they got you with the English. Uh, this is fun to watch. Isn't it? watching them like... Because you don't want them to leave off stage. So you're like, stay. <laughs> and then they do waves. Uh -huh. Oh, so cute. cute. It's like a freestyle. Can I see me? It's a battle. Oh, not tumbler. Oh my god. Nice. A little boo roll. Wait, wow. I didn't know he could dance like this. So oh. this is, so he this is does popping. have. Yeah, this is popping pop. He does have a uh, training well, like this. He's not, doesn't seem to have the strongest pops. Yeah. But he has very clean pathways. So more like electric boo style um, dancing here. Little mini twist of flex. Lots of good boo rolls. Oh, nice. I didn't even know he knows how to do this style of dancing. I thought I it was just contemporary that he knew. <laughs> how cute! Look, he looks so baby. He still got the stops though, right? He got the. Ah. Hey. Very like beautiful pictures. I actually. I mean, and how old is this, right? Like. Yeah. He looks like he's like fourteen to seventeen. A baby. A baby. You know, as Asian people, we get to like, like, we're like. 18 years old until we're 50, and then we melt. Yeah, his um, his pops aren't super strong during this era. Is it like that? Oh, I'm not a popper. Try but it, like, it. Yeah, it's exactly that that thing at the end, right? Yeah, it's it's the actual like pop line. Like as you notice, like he just has these beautiful pathways with uh -huh. his like legs. He knows where he's going. He knows where he's stepping. He knows where he's curling and contorting his body. He has great holds. He's like, and he has like stops, but he, there's no pop. Yeah, the pop is just not powerful enough. And it's it's kind of something I call attention to with like, I call attention to it with J Hope. Uh -huh. It's like as the years went on, J Hope sort of doesn't pop as hard anymore. He does it with his upper body well, but his legs he doesn't use well. But I also think that's due to popping with your legs will make you sing like this, <laughs> you know? But in this case, <laughs> they're not singing. So yeah, it's just like, I, I, he's not popping with his legs. And so it doesn't make it look as powerful. He just does it a little bit with his upper body. Wow. You didn't wow. even know he had that in him, huh? No, I've never seen this video before. That was impressive. I didn't even know he had this kind of training done. Like, it's nice to see his dance history, mm -hmm. I guess, you know? Because, like, obviously a great dancer, but yeah. it's nice to see where he started, I mm -hmm. guess. And then it reads, like, if you want to be a good dancer, it's best to be able to try these other styles and see which yes. one you like. Like, let me ask you a question. Yeah, got it. Why did you get into, like, hip hop and choreo in the first place? One, I liked the music and I just like liked how my body was dancing to it. Hmm. A lot of people that dance hip hop are really great at 
filling where there isn't much in a beat. He actually has the ability to dance to this more complex like experimental music and mm -hmm. also to music that has more consistent beats, which is why it almost looks like everything's natural. It was the first thing that you said, it was like, I just like the music. Yeah. And I think like for anyone here who wants to get into dancing or maybe you're doing K-pop covers already mm. and sometimes you might feel like, I don't know, if I'm not quite as good at good at this one. You know, I'm not like Ellen and Brian and like all these people, like why, why can't my body do it? If you want to dance, find music that you like, but also find things that you you just start moving to. Yeah. Yeah. Just vibe with it. Just vibe with it. I just appreciate how hard they work mm. as dancers, as artists, mm. as just everything. They work really, really hard in their dancing. Mm. So I appreciate them and I love them. I had a great time watching Jimin. I didn't know anything really about him. I just kind of mm -hmm. saw after watching the J-Hope videos, <laughs> like seeing him on the side. So I didn't know he was that skilled. I'm very impressed with how original he looks as a dancer. Mm. It's not the fact that, oh, he practiced this a long time ago. It's, you don't, you can't still do an aerial 10 years later if you haven't practiced it. He's practicing yeah. this. He's practicing that cheat gainer. He's practicing the aerial. Like the hard work shows and I don't even watch their videos of them working on things. So mm -hmm. that is crazy impressive. I am now officially a fan of Jimin as well. Ooh, and his, and his quads. And, and oh my gosh, those juicy quads? <laughs> you kidding me right now? <laughs> thank you everyone for watching this video of us reacting to Jimin's dancing. Uh, I'd really like to thank Nava Rose for coming in here. Where thank do, you. Where do people find you online? Ooh, should I throw out my socials? Throw in the socials. <laughs> All right, you can find me at, at the Nava Rose on Instagram and on YouTube, and then at the dot Nava Rose on TikTok because mm. someone apparently took it. Someone took it? Yeah, I don't know who. I don't know. Take it down. <gasps> Or at least, yeah, give it to me. We really enjoyed watching this video of Jimin dancing, and we want to know what other artists you want to see us react to. So please leave a comment down below of your favorite artists so that we can react to the dancing. And also, let us know what performances in particular, because then we'll react to that performance that you want to watch. Everyone, make sure to like this video and subscribe to the Steezy channel if you haven't done so already. And do the same for the Nava Rose channel. Yeah. Mm. Oh, was that enough pizzazz? That was pizzazz. <laughs> I love it. See ya. Yeah. One more time, three, two, one. See ya! Okay, even louder, three, two, one. See ya! Super quiet, three, two, one.